my friend? Mm -hmm. Right. So I'm a fan. Okay. Let's go ahead and jump right into this game at number one here. Kamal going to face talk off against assertively, Lissy. so we can we can hear it over the game. Okay, so Kamal goes with Gengar. I don't know why. I wish I remember what you told me yesterday about fighting Chandelure. No, it's something else. Anyway, all right, he's he's feeling pretty early. Ah. Uh, Nice! Oh, 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 this is bad. Could be a lot of damage here. It makes me wonder if, if, if people, people have just been hit by everything in the book already. They're like, no, I don't have this. He seems to match more paper time and time again. And that, <laughs> that's not a joke, it's just about today. Just in general, we're going to open, but. Yeah, both these two guys, at this point in time in practice, is certainly not a match. Let's see how far that knowledge goes. Oh! Okay, a little too fair. Good preemptive. respect. That's right, a little too fair on the overheat, but there is Espeon. I guess it didn't go up high enough because he wasn't raging fire did I'm not sure. Yeah. Interesting. Ah! Just keep doing it. Tracy does not want to get any closer than he has to be. And 2x. Is it 2y? No, that's 2y. Keep picking her nice and far away. Okay. Ah! Second left though. Okay, he's backing off. He's backing off. I love how Tuxi is just being patient. He's like, he's not pushing tons of buttons trying to get that last bit of HP away. He's just like, I have a life lead. I'm going to be as patient as I can be. Oh, he's a little too early to grab, but if at first he don't succeed, try, try again. Minimize debuffs, but it's okay for Tuxi because right. he has the life lead. Alright. Right into this next game here. The immediate phase shift. Wasted Ooh. little to no time. Okay. See who's gonna get after this. Yep. Smart man. Okay. Much better position here than the mm, first round. You cannot grab that much. Yeah, it's kind of hard not to. Like, when I think of grabbing and poking, I think of, like, back to Dreamhack Day, where, like, remember, uh, with Dave, why would Dave oh, get, like, yeah. 12 grabs in a row? Like, now, I know now they just call him grabs with Dave. Grab with Dave. He yeah. just grabs so much. I mean, how can yeah. you not? Because you get one, and it feels so good in poking, oh depending God. on what character <laughs> you're playing. Oh, man. nice. Nice, nice. So you got to pick your points off the a little bit better. Uh, oh, wow. Did he? Oh, did he? Oh, oh what did wow. he do? What did he do? <laughs> he got hit is what he did. Trixie, I believe. Okay, I've been wrong before, so I'm not gonna say anything. Okay, uh, he's gonna take the first game. Wow. Every time overheat lands, I, I respect people who land it because it's, it's that kind of risky because you get the debuffs, but every time it lands, it just hurts oh, yeah. to watch, to get hit by, probably even to use it because you're just like, man, I just landed this explosive thing on somebody. <laughs> Yeah, the risk reward, you know, for overheat. I mean, you know, what comes of that. And it's not even like the highest damage outputting move in the game. It's just the fact that it blows up everything you ever wanted to do. That's right. This just makes it so something you need to fear. It adds a lot of depth to the matchup too, because it forces, uh, you know, there are some chandeliers who are very overheat happy, and then of course there are some chandeliers who are not. Mm. You know, they, and they don't quite use that move. Um, you know, so obviously if you are. We're going to see a lot of Espeon, Umbreon support set. Obviously oh, yeah. more Espeon than anything, but... Other people yeah. like uh, Mew, Umbreon, or Mew, I don't know. It's, Mew's not super reliable. Populio's nice, too. <laughs> not that anybody really uses the double jump, but you, know, you get your buffs gone. And you get an attack buff, so... Why not? You know, you get... All right, so very, very interesting game number one there. Twixie looking very calm, cool, collected. Same could be said for Kamal, though. You know, mm -hmm. Kamal, very poised. Certainly feeling himself. You gotta stay composed to be this late in bracket. Of course, this has to still be winners if, if Twixie is, is playing, if mm -hmm. I'm mistaken, right? Yeah, so. Yeah. Winners semis, top 12. That's right. So there's certainly quite a bit on the line here that access, that entry into top 8 on a certain side. Okay. Uh, let's see, we from Gengar to Sceptile. Ooh. I love this because Gengar, Sceptile's yeah. range plus his speed <laughs> helps you in this matchup too, I think. Right. And all these, like, setups and traps are so hard to handle or to get. 
Penny getting, for own he's getting least played out. I like, mm. oh wow, okay, he's just comfortable. We're just tossing that out. Let's see, that's why it helps so much to play different characters. His mm. game plan just feels so different than it was before because now he's got some battle buttons. Oh! Wow, that's a wow. Yeah, he's got the attack debuff. That's right, yeah. Uh, special attack debuff, mm. ain't it? Is that what it is? Uh, I think they're all the same. Yeah. Oh no. Oh, that's punishable. Yup. Even by Chandler. Poke! Uh, oh wait, he's to go for Lee's no. four bears overheat. My bad. Trixie is so good, he's to go overheat. Okay, he knows. A little bit more hesitant on how he decides to come in. I mean, in. he, he has that. the life lead, but if Chandler gets up to me, we'll lose. Okay, he knows that. Oh, okay, here's Espeon. Smart. Oh, is he actually about to... Oh, he is oh. shit flash kick. Alright. I'm, I'm a, see, I'm not a top player, that's why I'm here not in bracket, but why is he so close to Chandler when he has the life lead? Ah, he's a madman. To do that! What, he's to a madman. You see his face? Like, okay, I can do this. This can happen. I like this support set for him, too, man. It allows him to kind of maneuver around, especially in field phase with him, because he knows Chandler's going to set the track, especially after overheat. I remember, fun fact, uh, first sports go, uh, someone was saying that just having the speed versus Chandler helps so much, even in, like, Chandler's the most winning matchups, if, you're, if you get that speed bump. Oh! Yeah. Delicious. Most of two in a row. What type of wall combos you got to get? Boom, okay. okay so Chandler, I think, follows, like, a lot faster than you would think, so he has to limit it a little bit. This man is actually out of control. No synergy burst for you! Okay, still staying the trap though. This is a really interesting position here for Twixie to be in. Back into the corner, there's the bad breath. <laughs> Don't get out of my head space. What are you doing? Kamal is so close. He's, he's play ah, Twixie oh. is starting to mix up his game a lot more though. I don't think I've seen him willingly go up and grab this entire game. No, not at all. <laughs> That's exactly what you were talking about. Get the speed needed, especially in field phase. Runs right up, mm -hmm. gets a little too close. Watch yourself with that only attack, man. Oh! Alright, I think that just gives him the life edge. Was that just a runner grab or did he see what he I grabbing? think that was just a runner grab. That was really cool. I mean, I blinked and he was already there. Okay, we're hanging out. Uh, Again. Ah, oh, no! Are you kidding me? No! Are you kidding me? My lad, he has a counter burst. Yeah, if, if this doesn't kill, he's going to get the life lead. That ain't oh, right. He was, he that ain't so right. close. But this is this is okay because now Kamal is back. Actually, he has burst, so he can bring us back. That's right. And Shandler is going to have so such a hard time getting burst back. Get some dragon breath going on up here. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and get right into this. this match has certainly been a nail biter. Okay, there's flash kick. Good guard. Twixie looking good here. I feel like he's showing, I want him to be more disrespectful because you are mega septile. You have this mega grab that we're about to see. Do some mega damage. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now put on some pressure. Just, or just grab. Let him grab. Yep. Pr Somehow Chandler got burst. How did that even happen? You know what this is like. <gasps> he almost got me level of eager grab there. What? Oh no, no. no. I gotta look up this frame data to see how that worked, but it did. That's what matters. At least Kamal doesn't have to worry about burst attack anymore. <laughs> That's also true. Okay, still a bit of life left in here. I don't want to put the plug in him quite yet, you know. He has the life. He had the life lead. Oh my goodness! And now he's on life support. Really rough position. Oh and be and try no! To... Oh my! See, technically. Twixie could have just murdered him with Hex, mm -hmm. but as soon as Chandler jumped, it's like, no, it's not gonna Hex. You, you need to get out of the air. You're Sorry. gonna get you a laser. <laughs> I don't know if Seta has such an option, but at that point, he knew mm -hmm. that it was laser time. <laughs> he was.